Hey guys, today is Tuesday and I am here at my um, facial appointment here at Magnolia Med Spa. Today I am getting the chemical pill, um, my first chemical pill ever, so I'm really, really nervous um, for a lot of reasons, but I feel like this is something that is going to benefit my skin and um, it's just about time I stop playing around and go ahead and just do it. So I'm um, here. My appointment is at two o'clock. It is currently 1.50, so I'm kind of early. Let's go ahead and go in. guys I am done with my appointment and oh my gosh that chemical peel is something serious um, it definitely definitely has that stinging and burning effect you guys I'm talking about to the point where I felt like my arms were going weak <laughs> because it was so intense so I didn't vlog the whole time she was doing it because it was getting that intense so she just did like one layer first with the brush and then she did a second layer um, the first layer when she first placed it, it didn't sting too bad and then like two minutes later it really started stinging then she did another layer then she did spot treatment with it and then um, she placed a serum to cool it down so the serum when she places it it kind of gets hot and then it cools it down so you definitely can feel like it's coming down in your body the way your body reacts to it is like I don't know if it's like I was talking to her and I don't know if it's like your adrenaline is like whoa what is going on she did give me like after instructions not to be in the sun you can't take a hot shower do not wash my I can't wash my face tonight um, she did give me a kit and I'll show you guys the kit she gave me so this is the kit that I purchased and just has like your face wash in it a sunscreen a balm a moisturizer and does have a steroid cream just in case you start burning or experiencing you know um itching i'm gonna begin to use this uh, kit tomorrow so the chemical peel basically is getting to the nitty-gritty so i feel like i needed to go this route because everything i'm doing for my skin at this point i feel like it's just band-aiding it i felt like i feel like because i get so many hormonal breakouts i need something that's going to get this under control so this is why i um chose to go ahead and do the chemical peel she said that maybe three treatments will work for me so i'm hoping because the process of this you guys is Woo! It's like you got to talk yourself and feel like my nerves were so bad. I need to take a nap. <laughs> so I'm going to go in the house. I'm going to take a nap and relax and kind of reflect on what just happened. Okay, you guys. Today is Wednesday, day two after my chemical peel. Um, and this is the day that I'm able to actually wash my face. So I'm going to show you guys the kit, which I showed you guys yesterday. It gives you instruction on how to use each product. And my esthetician already went over all that with me. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get into the face wash. So relieved to be able to wash my face because it's obviously something I do every night. Which my face felt really moisturized last night after I got home. After I left there, my face was burning a little, um, which is normal. But when I got home, you know, um, my face was fine. They don't really smell like anything, which is great. Okay, I'm gonna wash my hands again. I'm gonna go in with the facial wash, about that much. And massage into the hands. 
gonna add some water. There we go. And as far as how my face feels, um, the soreness, I'm still a little sore here because those are where I had the extractions done. Not as sore as I was yesterday. Making sure that I'm cleansing effectively, but not harsh. Pat dry the skin with a nice clean towel, face towel. My face towels, I wash separately than the towels I use like for my body. So I'm only using these on my face. I'm gonna go in with the Rebalance Moisturizer. Around this area where it's rough, I'm gonna just pat the moisturizer instead of swiping across the skin. I'm just gonna kind of pat, okay? Then, lastly, I'm going in with the Perfecting Protection Broad Spectrum SPF 30. About that much. I know that my skin is gonna be protected Especially getting a chemical pill, you guys, make sure that you are using a sunscreen. If you're, even if you're exfoliating at home, sunscreen, sunscreen, sunscreen. I'm just gonna massage, oh, that feels good. Mm, that feels very, very, wow. Feels very silky and mm, I'm gonna put some on my, this area too, because this is where she did the chemical peel also. Which you can apply your products to your neck anyway, but she applied like the chemical peel right here too. Put me some Carmex on so these are dry. What am I expecting in day two? I'm expecting for my skin to start peeling, I guess. Um, my, esthetic, my esthetician did tell me that doing the mid chemical peel, I would peel for three days. I don't feel really moisturized right now. I like for my skin to feel moisturized, but I'm gonna follow all the directions. I'm not gonna use any of my products because you have to use the kit that they give you so that you're not, your skin doesn't get irritated you know, using other products that may have other ingredients in it that your skin is not ready for right now because it's going through a process. But I'm gonna keep you guys posted on my actual process and journey of this chemical peel. And I'm being positive and I am going to be patient with my skin because this is not something that happens overnight. But I just want to share my first chemical peel experience with you guys. If you guys have gotten a chemical peel or thinking of getting one, Leave me a comment below if you want to ask any questions about the whole procedure um, from yesterday. So just let me know. And if you're thinking about it, doing it, just do your research. Make sure you talk to your esthetician. Ask as many questions as you can. It's so far so good. My skin is not inflamed. It's not burning. And I'm not having any kind of side effects right now. That completes the end of this video. If you guys have not subscribed, click that subscribe button and I will see you guys in my next video.